I feel like Dead Space just hasn't gotten its time in the spotlight. Like, I, I swear, I know it's popular, right? Like, people like it, but it should have always been, like, the next Resident Evil or something, I felt like. And this remake hopefully will put it there. But good God, it was so good. I mean, Dead Space in general, like, this game was terrifying. I never felt safe playing this game. Uh, you get attacked even at the save points, the tram station, uh, outside the shops. Like, you're nowhere safe. You're constantly hearing noises in the vents because you can be attacked anywhere. Sometimes the environment, like the shower, will just, like, freak you out for no reason. You're, like, you're just trying to use the bathroom. Come on, man. And then uh, the lights will actually go out in a random room. Like, it's not even scripted. It's just, they'll just go out and stay out. The the fans or environment will just like get like overcharged or something and start freaking out spinning like crazy and break and then that's it you don't get attacked it's just like the electronics failing because the ishimura is in such bad shape the doors some of the doors start opening slower and slower like it's so good i love this remake like all the work put into this remake it was clearly done by people who were fans of the game just like us and it's super appreciated so i gotta be honest my favorite part of these isn't the horror part it is more of the survivor part and let me tell you isaac is one heck of a survivor you get so much variety in these weapons you get a total of eight so seven of them you're gonna find throughout the game uh some are just gonna be on forward path some are gonna be locked in uh higher clearance doors which is something you upgrade throughout the game and so it gives you good reason to explore around to previous areas once you've beaten that section of the game which is pretty cool uh the upgrade systems itself the plasma cutter right there has one that applies a damage over time to its shots and lots of guns have stuff like that and just look at how many nodes you need it's super cool i love when games like this have uh tons of upgrades you can upgrade your suit for more health more air more stasis uh charges the stasis will last longer it'll reach more like bigger aoe from where you hit with it and i love that when you do that it upgrades your your ui the ui in dead space is always going to be the best no matter what like it's not in your face it's not covering any part of the screen it's just on your back and it's so cool so the plasma cutter like it i, I feel like it's iconic right but it's not even probably the coolest weapon in dead space like look at this contact beam it just shoots out this laser it's so cool uh dead space has to have some of the most creative weapons in a survival action horror game uh the force gun just knock everything away or suck everything in with these like black holes they're called gravity wells but they look like black holes like this game is so freaking creative i love it it looks so cool so for me, the thing I hate about horror, a lot of horror, is when they make the characters so dumb, they do dumb decisions and whatnot. But Dead Space, I felt like they did such a good job with the story because, like this scene, Hammond, I felt like Hammond was such a compassionate character. He cared about his crew. Uh, there's a scene early on when he reassures Isaac about Nicole, and I thought that was, like, super sweet of him. Like, he just seems like a good guy overall. Uh, he can't even, like, take out Chen here who uh, dies in the beginning of the game. So he, you know, he doesn't want to do it. So he takes him out through the escape pod, launches him out. And what that leads to, I was just like, oh man, like if you know where it, what happens afterwards, like that didn't seem like a dumb decision. That wasn't because Hammond was dumb. It was because he had trouble, you know, like any zombie show, it's always like, would you be able to take out your friend if they turn into a zombie? Like, <laughs> like I don't know, I felt bad for him. So yeah, like overall, I enjoyed this cast of characters. I liked Isaac uh, doing the side, their side missions in here so you can learn more about Nicole. I like Nicole a lot. Um, the villain. I thought Dr. Mercer was such a cool villain. Like I hated the dude, but he didn't just seem like an idiot completely, I guess, by the end of it. I mean, all these guys that want to be made whole. I mean, you kind of know what happens to them if you know how they're made whole. But him and his pet hunter were pretty pretty awesome parts of the game. I I hated the parts of the hunter as that's that's one of the most uh, helpless situations is invincible enemies in these types of game. But uh, 
he he was cool. Danny was cool. Hammond was cool. A lot like I feel like every character they put in here I liked. Like there was no there was no bad characters in Dead Space in this Dead Space. So like props to them for the story. And it's not even just that the the environmental storytelling like you're gonna get tons of collectibles, tons of audio logs, and like the story they tell you without even having to play as those characters. Like it's so like it's very messed up, but it's very well done. Some of them are just so horrible, like it's heartbreaking. Uh there's one when you get the when you upgrade your clearance one of the times, you're probably gonna run into that log. If you listen to it, uh you know what happens. And then you see the body and it's missing like limbs and like oh man, it's so messed up. So I feel like I've covered pretty much everything. The story is awesome. The characters are great. The guns are amazing. The zero G sections are cool too, actually. I have to give this game a 10 out of 10. It's perfect. It's everything I want in a survival action horror. It's so freaking cool, creative. Uh, I'll thank the devs. Thanks to EA for giving it another shot. I hope Dead Space continues. I hope it's someday as popular as Resident Evil. I hope one day I'm sick of watching new Dead Space movies or TV shows that come out or something. Like, I don't know. Just John Carpenter's available, I heard. If you guys want to try a movie, I don't know. I'm just saying. But just please keep Dead Space going. I love it. It's Thank you for this remake. 10 of 10.